Now, another player that played a, a very uh, important part last season at linebacker is Dylan Doyle, and he also came to came into his own last season after Bernard suffered that injury. And, and Doyle, he's one of those single-digit number guys, and as we know from Matt Rule's era, we, that's carried on that they were one of the toughest guys on the field mentally and physically. And he talks about what it means making it to the Sugar Bowl and seeing his dreams finally come to fruition. We fully recognize that we're we're preparing to go to war on Saturday night. Um, we respect their team quite a bit, and we really feel like all eyes are going to be on us. And so, I mean, it, it's the stuff that you dream about as a little kid. We're going to be playing in, I mean, one of the premier sporting venues in the entire world. I mean, traditionally, bowl experiences come with quite a few distractions, and Coach Aranda talks about most prepared, least distracted uh, teams win in bowl games. And I think a lot of times you see teams in bowl games perform outside of themselves, either performing well or performing poorly. And we're just trying to be consistent and, and show our DNA on tape. So there's a lot of excitement, obviously, surrounding this whole this whole weekend, and we're getting a lot of uh, kind of different, interesting weather. Right now, you can kind of see a little bit of fog, and next time, I might bring some earbuds just because, or earplugs, rather, because uh, there were some fireworks going on as well. But it's been a lot of fun down in New Orleans, and we'll have you covered every step of the way. Thanks to TFNB, Baylor University Athletics, official local bank, your bank for life. And for now, I will send it back to you in the studio, Noelle.